No, due to YouTube's copyright infringement policy, the music has been turned off completely. So, sorry about that. What it be, bros and brownies, this is Razor, and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And we are, once again, right where we left off last time. Well, not exactly right where we left off last time, because I've done a few of the quests that I had here. And I replaced Candrus with Johanni, since... When I was delivering a package to Anchorhead, to a hut in Anchorhead, I, well, ran, we got, uh, ran into by a, by a Twi'lek that said that he was involved in the destruction of Terrace. So, said that he's gonna appear again. In where is it? I think it was around here somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Right. All right. Let's talk oh, to this guy. Oh, hello to you. You're new to the academy, aren't you? I can't say we've ever met. Yep. Who are you? Galen Lor, at your service. All right. Um, Why not? Aren't there records? Not from this far back. Or at least what records do exist are sketchy at best. These ruins date back to a period when the Sith were first formed, before their exile into the far reaches of space. Right. What are you doing here? I've been working on a translation of some of the runes by this tomb. I'm quite excited. Right. Who is Ajanta Paul? Ajanta Paul was one of the first of the great Sith Lords. He rebelled against his Jedi Masters and led the way for the rest of us that followed. Right. These ruins claim that he was interred uh -huh. here. His sword? According to legend, a junt of Paul created a sword of terrible power. Right. Hasn't any ever been made to recover it? Well, a few of the Boulder students have tried. They did not... Right. Gain prestige? Certainly. Finding such an artifact and giving it to Master Uthar would do any. Right. What do you know about the sword's powers? Nothing at all. The legends don't say anything about it. It may have had powers only right. for. I'll be going now. Of course. Um, all right. So, just gonna be having a look in here. Things to sell, and into the tomb of a Genta Paul we go. is to be had in here. Right. No problem. Pick that. Got it. Not sure how that would make sense, but okay. Alright. There's a data pad. Maybe not. I was gonna say, let's see if I can at least do one Force Lightning, but I didn't do that. Okay. Let's see what this had. Nothing. Well, nothing usual. Well, nothing useful, I mean. Right. There's nothing on it. Let's see what one of the data pads that I picked up says. Sith archaeologist, must be uninteresting. Last entry, strange enough, found traces of something in the tomb. Usual used as fuel by lesser races. Used in power source. Have to be careful. All right, let's see what this one says. There has to. There's got to be a way to get past this obelisk block and some unstable material. Energy discharge. Let's fire. Didn't work. Try some explosives. Alright. Let's try the explosives. Alright. Let's put a... Let's try this. That worked. That all 
so look at the droids. So as you can see, I found a lightsaber crystal that I had in storage on the Ebonhawk. Not sure what that was supposed to do. Right, let's smash this. And let's disable this mine. Right. And continue on our way. There's three swords. Too long, too long in the cold and the dark. I am disturbed again. Oh, a human. Right. This you don't see every day. This, this is an old spirit full of right. Hey, Jedi, here? Why have you come to this dark place, Jedi? I was here before, I think. Don't you remember me? I do. And yet I do not. The Force is so strong with you, human. Are you... Ajanta Paul? I had a name once. Ajanta Paul. Yes, that was my name. I was one right. of many. In the end, we were not so... Uh -huh. You were a Sith Lord from the ancient times? Ancient? Has it been so long that you used the word ancient? Right. We were the first. The first to rebel. Okay. How did you fall? What happened? We hid from the Jedi. Right. We destroyed each uh -huh. other. <laughs> the Sith consumed themselves, did they? I suppose that eventually they... Right. And so, here, owls... Okay. The Sith fled. They returned. So much, so much time has. Why do you remain here? Remain? Do I remain? Right. My sword. I filled it. Uh -huh. I am dead as my faith. Right. I feel sorry for you. Most of my brethren would desire only to take. Okay. I wish my sword to be taken away. Right. Fine. I'll gladly take it out of here. There are three blades within my right. sword. Find the sword that is mine. Okay. My... And if the sword isn't yours? Then you must die. How will I know which sword it is? I do remember one thing of my sword. Right. I am that which grips the heart in fright. Harkens night and silences the light. Go then. Okay. So, let's have a look. If I remember right, it should be this one. Yeah. Ebony Black. Alright. I'm gonna have a look at this. Credits. Okay, now where is... Okay, I'm gonna save just in case I'm wrong. But I do remember it being a double-bladed vibro sword. Right? Yes, that is the one. That is the blade that destroyed yep. me. Take it. Take it and the other blades even. All right. There's no need to remain here, is there? No need? Right. You can return to the light side and end your torment. Return? But I betrayed my old... I didn't believe the dark side when would turn you away. You have suffered long enough. If if I could return, oh my master. Right. And I get some light side points. And I'm gonna be giving that sword to mission. 
And I'm um, low on time, so I'm just gonna stop the recording and start it up again. So I'll be right back. And I'm back. And once I'm out of here, I can gain some prestige. Oh. So the spineless worm actually made it through the tomb. I'm impressed. Chardon, what do you want? Isn't it obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work and return. Right. Oh, typical. Always ready to jump at what they okay. can. Now that you have it, I just thought I. Right. No. I think I'll manage it just fine. Kind of you to offer, though. Oh, but I insist. I'm not about to. Especially not for a pathetic excuse for a Sith. Right. And if I don't. Isn't it obvious? You die. Right. Just let me get it out. Now, what will you give me for it? This isn't a negotiation. As much as I... Right? Then you'll have to take it from me, Sith. I've been looking forward to this. <laughs> You have been vanquished by me, and I take these and be on my way. All right, you—you you have the sword, the sword of a. I got it from Ajanta himself, if you must know. Are you joking with me? The Sith Lord still li- No, not exactly. Oh, that is quite interesting. Uh, my mentor told me that Sith apparitions might be possible, right. but thank you for the information. Okay. Alright, now to give Mission the sword. Even though I don't use any of the regular characters that often, mostly the force sensitive ones, or the Jedi ones. Right. You should be careful if you're planning on entering. Right. Why? What do you know about it? There's an assassin droid in there, so Master Uthar says. It went insane and is holed up in there with a right. hole. Why didn't the Sith do anything about it? I don't know. I think Master Uthar has left it in there as a challenge for any student. Right. Supposedly, if a student actually succeeds. Uh -huh. Thanks, I'll be sure going thing. now. Alright, so there's a insane droid in here. The tomb of Marka Ragnos. And in we go. Intruders detected. <laughs> Initiate attack sequence. <laughs> Take what's in here. 
Mark of Ragnos is gone. And I think that's for Dark Side. Yeah, Dark Side characters. So if you're a Dark Side character, you can use these. But since I'm a pure Light Side, as you can see, I can't use them. Alright. Another tomb has been finished. Actually, I want to see if I can reload and see if I can do the peaceful one. Nope, didn't look like it. Oh well. It's just a extra thing that you can do. Alright, now into the tomb of Nagasato. Alright. Oh, I can't go in there. Hang on, I think that's where where my Sith trial goes. Alright, so the only tomb that I have yet to go through is the Tomb of Tulak Horde. Alright. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's a droid. Pair. And let's do all this. There we are. And got some experience out of it. Okay, Joe Honey. Jolie, you were in the way for a second. Is it Let's see where this way goes. A lot of shots. all there is on this side, so let's continue onwards, this way. Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? Yeah. The contact nerve toxin. Right. Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Horde, if you don't know. I've taken up res- right. Who are you? Oh, yes. Right. This other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name- Hand, isn't he the one that I met at the entrance? Yeah, I've been told about you. Liar! You think I can't tell? 
Right. Um, anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. Okay. Most of the Drek Uthar has been right. passed. Uh, I... uh -huh. Yes, yes. You're welcome. You see. Hmm. Look, I'm sure we can talk about this. I'm sure we could. We could chat all day about it. But where would that get right. me? Perhaps you have some questions. I'm not above delaying the test of what if I told you I was Darth Revan? <laughs> then I'd say you have quite an imagination. Right. And if I refuse to take your test? Well, forgive me for resorting to the cliché. Right. I refuse to play along. I don't remember offering you a choice. Right. So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Right. Miko here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much. Okay. I don't know what you think of Miko. Right. Go ahead. Well then, any right. <laughs> We can both survive. Now, now, dear. And how many correctly answered questions before you die? Right. On that note, now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? I used the opportunity to kill him and take his position. Correct! He was a fool to let down his guard. You will not... Right. You see me, Cole. It's not so difficult. Time for your punishment. And so we come to round two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you a reward. What do you do? I'll purposely say this one. So you've made a profit, and now you have some sniveling use right. at any rate. Let's see. Ah, yes. You discover an aspect of the Force that gives you great power. Do you share it and strengthen the Sith as a whole? Or keep it to your... I keep it to myself. Correct! Let them rip the secret from your cold, dead hand. Right. Well, it's sad to say. But it's that time again, Mika. Still going? All right, then. One of your underlings has made a major mistake which makes you look bad. He's normally very competent and skilled. Do you kill him or give him another chance? Give him another chance. Another chance to make you look poor to your superiors? To me? Right. Hmm. Not that good help is easy to find. Last question. You're about to die. Do you pass on your knowledge to your apprentice to make him stronger? Or do you use your last breath? I strike at my enemies. Fool. It's a trick question. A true Sith. I'll enjoy this one. Now, this is odd. The test is over and you're both still alive. Well, that's never happened before. Hmm. What to do? What to do? I suppose this means you can go, Miko. I'll have to just figure out right. what more. Or I could use the Force to free them. And we could kill you. Seems you didn't think of that, old man. What? Mutiny! Behave, students! I'll... That's it! Detention for all of you! Permanent detention! We'll see about that soon. <laughs> I guess he wasn't a true Sith after all. I can't believe that I'm alive. You saved me. You could have easily just answered those... Nobody deserves to die like that. Nobody. Yes. Well, I see what you mean. I've never... I mean, I've never been on that side of the fence before. I'd be dead if you weren't... I mean, if you were proper Sith. But you're not, are you? Don't worry. This could be your chance to change your ways, Mikkel. You mean... 
the light side? I've never thought about that. Can you... Can you even go back? Yep. I... I don't think the light side is for me. But maybe... Alright. Alright. Ancient Civ tablet. Alright. Let's see what two light cord left for me. <laughs> two light cords mask. Is this another Sith one? Yep. Alright, so we can't do anything with that. Alright, let's see what's in this. An upgrade for my lightsaber. Another upgrade. Alright. So what's in this one? Another upgrade? Yep. Well, not really, it's a lightsaber crystal, but... It's close enough. Alright, so... Let's head back to to the Sith Uthar. That is what his name is, right? Need to wait for Johanny and Jolie to come. Alright, and while I'm waiting for them to catch up, I'll heal myself. Here we are. Yes. Alright, here they come. What? Alright. And once I'm... <sighs> and once I talk to... Actually, once I'm at the Master Uthar's area, I'll call it a video there. And we made some progress and gained some prestige. And here's where I'm gonna call it a video, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and all that good stuff, and I'll be sure to make more. And also, be sure to press the bell icon next to the subscribe button while you're subscribing so that you can get notified of when I make videos. And if you got any hints, tips, or tricks on any of the playthroughs that I'm currently doing, which is this and The Witcher, be sure to let me know. So, until next time, later haters.